Hello everybody, my name is Vincent Law, a math Jedi, always ready to attack math bombs. And today, we're going to be attacking the 2016 AMC 8 Palm 25. A semicircle is inscribed in an isosceles triangle with base 16 and height 15, so that the diameter of the semicircle is contained in the base of the triangle as shown. What is the radius of the semicircle? Before I like to start these type of problems, I always like to label the points. Let this point be A, this point be B, and this point be C. The problem tells us that the base, BC, is 16. So BC is equal to 16. It also tells us that the height is 15. Let D be a point in BC such that AD is perpendicular to BC. Since triangle ABC is isosceles, this means that AD is perpendicular to B, is the perpendicular bisector to CB, which means that it cuts CB in half. So DB is 8 and CB is 8. Now let's find the plan of attack to solve this problem. Let's zoom in on triangle ADB. A simple way to find its area is db times ad over 2. But let's look at a different way of finding its area. This time, let ad be the base. The tangency point of the semicircle and line ab be point e. This means that Line DE is the height of triangle ABD. DE is perpendicular to AB because any line tangent to a circle is always perpendicular to the radius of the circle. Aha! We have found the secret weapon to attack this problem. Line DE is not only the height of triangle ABD, it is also the radius of the circle, which is what we're trying to find. Let DE be R. DB times AD over 2 is equal to AD times DE over 2. We can find line segment AB by the Pythagorean theorem. Now, let's do some number crunching. We substitute the values of DB and AD into the equation. DB is 8, AD is 15. We can find line segment AB by the Pythagorean theorem. A squared plus B squared equal to C squared. A in this case is equal to DB, and B in this case is equal to DA. C is equal to AB. We plug in values. To get that, AB squared is equal to 289, and AB equals 17. We plug the value of AB into this equation, 17, to get 17R over 2. Solving for R, we get 240 equals 34R, and R equals 240 over 37, which this can simplify to 120 over 17, which is answer choice B. Problem conquered. Thanks for watching.